guys welcome back to the channel this video is just about me getting ready for a vacation that we're taking and i already got my uh bullet journal slash planner uh kind of um uh kind of separated in a way that has August one. No major plans yet, but um, July is going to be getting um, actually leaving for our vacation. We're going to this uh, beach vacation, and we're just planning to spend a few days down there and um, get away from the house and the area. So, what I wanted to go ahead and share with you guys is I did get a little bit of stuff at. So I have you guys a Crooked. Uh, that's better. Yeah, that's better. Now you're going to see the next side but okay, just tilt your head to the side. Got a couple of stuff for the uh, vacation. I got myself um, little, cute little flasters because they have uh, flavors for my granddaughter. Yeah. And then I got some more little stuff for the house. Um, got myself another one of these. I don't know what happened to the other one. I usually put like a vinyl on here and I put my ginger ale in here to drink. And I got myself more of these because I enjoy these. I get myself a cup of coffee at Jack and it usually drips. And this keeps it from, um, you know, spreading. It absorbs it. We got one that says... This home is filled with love. And I got one that says blessed. Because I feel blessed every morning to wake up. And then a couple of scissors. I wanted to try these. Um, Westcott is a very good brand. This is the 8 inch and this is the uh, titanium 7 inch. And they say that it's really good. I also got some uh, flowers for the summer and tree in fall. As you guys know, these are starting fall uh, Mother's Day hasn't even come and gone and already we have nothing left at our Dollar Tree. We got a little bucket for the summer. And then um got these really neat uh it says notes organizer. I don't know if you guys have these at your Dollar Tree but this is perfect for projects that you might be working on and you can just go ahead and put little tabs on them and just you know be like this is what i'm working on uh completed or whatever even for orders to begin if you don't have a lot of orders you just want to use that you can use that i did find some really nice filing uh folders lemons and then uh for the dollar tree that was basically it um they get some remnants they're 75 percent off right now uh this is the fleece Got some of that. My granddaughter wanted some. Uh, sorry about that. Granddaughter wanted some uh, picnic blanket for her Barbie, so I got these two. It's uh, almost Fourth of July, so I thought this would be perfect for some blankets for her. Um, got a notepad for some odds and ends. Uh, I got this uh, minky. It's a lavender color. This is going to go to a very special little girl. And I got these. Guys, if you've seen Walmart, it, these are two for $12.98. Uh, and the Dollar Tree, two for a dollar, two for two dollars. And there is endless things that you can do with this. And uh, give them as gifts or keep them for yourself. One of the things you can do is keep it in your purse when you're organizing things and if you just need to take this out, uh, snacks, uh, stay tuned for a video of what I might be doing with this. Then I went to the baby section and they have t-shirts sometimes. Well, I found onesies. Let's see if you guys can get it. Uh, you know Halloween is coming and these little onesies will be perfect for little gifts. I have 
friends who have babies. I have uh, babies being born and I love to give them a cute little thing for them. That tons of colors. This one I think would be perfect for like a Christmas or it's so cute. I don't have little ones anymore. All of my little ones are big. I have my uh, granddaughter who's now five so she doesn't even use these but these are perfect guys. If you guys find them, grab them. You can use HTV or embroider something on them. And um, this gifts. Find someone who needs a little thing um, and just give them away. Or, you know, if you sell them on Etsy, sell them on Etsy. Uh, and then I want to show you what I got at Japan's. These are remnants. This is gorgeous for a pillow. Found this. Look at this. For a pillow, you can cut this into a square piece and make it into a pillow. Hopefully you guys heard. Um, then I got these. I have an idea of what I want to do uh, with this, so stay tuned for a video with that. I did get from my embroidery machine. I have a uh, tear away, but I wanted to get some cutaway for the minky. So I'm going to be making a minky blanket for a very special little girl. Um, if my friend is watching, you know who she is. Another one of these. I did find some material for Halloween. These are perfect for headbands. Those are soft. Or for what they call bummies. I call them diaper covers. There's another one. Really adorable little Halloween. And this goes perfect with this. Look at that. See? Perfect. And a little pumpkin there. Or maybe a little witch or a little candy corn. I did find this because I didn't know I was going to find the uh, orange onesies. So we got this to match it. And there's this one. Let me show you really close up what I got here. See these little doggies? Aren't they adorable? And they're little pumpkin. So cute. Fourth of July. I'm making a little onesie. Special little girl. She is going to be receiving some gifts um, this coming week. Here's this other side of the minky. This is a flannel that I'm planning to let's see if you guys it's upside down. Um, the purple would be perfect for a little blanket. There you guys go. And then I found this, which is a marine vinyl. 75% uh, off this price. I don't know if you guys can see it. I hope you guys can. 75% off. So that is what I got. I don't remember getting anything else um, other than that. Really, I didn't shop for a lot. But I'm happy I got all that stuff. And those are going to be crafts pretty soon. So stay tuned for all the videos that are will be popping back up after my long hiatus. I will be doing videos. And if you guys didn't watch my first video, uh, I'm back. Uh, go back down there and watch that one. The description will be down below and the link will be down below or up here somewhere or up there. Depends on where the little bubble pops up. I'm always confused on what happens. So stay tuned and I'll see you guys later.